Hey everyone, so today I'm going to do a review on some Sally Hansen lip products. I have three different products, but I have um, three colors in one product. So I'm going to get started with the one. This is the Smile Brightening Lip Treatment. This is in Gleaming. And basically what it's supposed to do is the glitter that's inside is supposed to contract the yellow in your teeth, making them whiter. And so this is what it looks like. And it looks awesome. Like, I love the packaging. I got this at the dollar store for, I think, two bucks. And it smells minty. As for um, making my teeth look whiter, I don't know if it actually does that, but I love the color. I'll do a swatch for you. And it's just this pink color. It's not a very good swatch. Let's try it some more. So it's that color right there, and that is true to color. And I'll put this one on. Now this is, I wouldn't call this a sticky lip gloss, but it's got like a thicker texture to it. And I like the color. Does it make my teeth look whiter? I don't know. I don't think it actually does. But um, I like the lip gloss. I'm going to wipe it off because I'm going to put something else on my lips. And um, I like the color and it came in a bunch of different colors. But I only picked up one because I wanted to try it. Um, like I said, I don't think it makes my teeth look whiter. But um, I love the products, you know, it smells minty, so can't go wrong there. So that is that one. The next product is the Moist and Matte Lip Color. This is in linen. And as you can tell, I've already used this. I'm going to wipe some of it off. Okay, so this is basically kind of like a dark nude colored. And I think what it says is that it was infused with some... I don't know, some plum or something like that? I don't know, but you just twist up the bottom and it comes up like that. Put it on like that. So just like a nude color. Um, it's a little opaque, so when you put some on, if you layer it on, then you know you won't be able to see your natural lip color. I'm going to take it off. This isn't my favorite, um, this is kind of like a thicker lip gloss to, um, I don't know, it, there, there's just something about it that I don't like, I don't like the smell, and I think just how it rolls up is, it comes out uneven, and then when you put it on your lips, like I said, you, you have to put on a couple coats of this to get the actual color that is right here, and this is a beautiful color, they had like, um, more colors, they had a bright orange one, but I'm not the type of person to like, Bam color. It wasn't coral, it was bright orange. Like, I don't even have anything over here to show you how bright it was, but um, if I see any more, I'm going to pick some up, you know, maybe try a different color, maybe just this color I don't like, or maybe the scent of it I don't like. I'm not sure, so. And I got this at the dollar store as well for two bucks. And the last thing are the Soothing Lip Tints, and this is the Natural Beauty, and I have three of them. So this kind of like hot pink one is called Pink Berry. The clear one is called Clear. So obviously this isn't going to tint your lips clear. And then this one is in Cranberry. Here, I'll put Pink Berry and Cranberry side by side so you can see. So the top one's Pink Berry, the bottom one is Cranberry. Now I started off with the Cranberry one and I liked it so much that I bought another one. And a little goes a long ways for these. Um, so these are the applicators. They're kind of like rubbery. So they're bendable. And you push them. And it comes out through there. You can't really see it. But the Pinkberry. I don't know what Pinkberry is supposed to smell like. But this is kind of fruity. And smells like candy at the same time. So that's that one. The clear one, obviously I just like to put it over lipstick. If I don't have... A lip gloss that I want in cranberry. And cranberry smells kind of like cranberries with kind of like that cake scent to it. I don't know. So I don't think these really tint your lips all that much, but they are a lighter lip gloss, so I like putting them on. Like that. And I got these at the dollar store as well for two bucks, so they're steel and they're great. 
and I love them, and they're nice and light on your lips, and they stay they stay longer than the other two that I showed you. The other two I showed you um, don't really stay on that long. This one is kind of thick, but I feel like it just kind of like washes away, and this one kind of, um, it feels kind of cakey, I don't know, it's kind of hard to explain, but this one comes off really quickly. These are the longest lasting ones, and if I could find more, I would buy more, because these colors and scents are amazing. So, thank you guys for watching, I hope you enjoyed this review.